Intergroup Mining has a major gold exploration project approximately 250 kilometres from the seaport of Townsville in North Queensland, Australia. The project is ideally situated within an underexplored area of the famous Charters Towers Gold Province, which has produced over 20 million ounces of gold and hosts several major gold mines. Among these are Ravenswood, operated by Resolute Mining, which produced approximately 4 million ounces of gold. The nearby Mount Wright underground mine, also operated by Resolute, which is producing high-grade ore with a current head grade of 3 grams per tonne. The famous Mount Lation gold mine, which produced in excess of 5 million ounces of gold during its lifetime. Pajingo and Vera Nancy, operated by Evolution Mining, along with Charters Towers itself, which yielded over 7 million ounces of gold and has a population of over 8,000. The geology of the project area is dominated by granites with most of the recognised target areas present along linear geological structures typically favourable for gold mineralisation. These overlapping structures are of different ages, allowing mineralising fluids to fracture the rocks along already weak zones and alter the fabric of the rocks, creating sites for the injection of quartz veins containing gold and associated elements from deep below the surface. A close review of the outcropping geology and stream sampling has narrowed the focus to two areas referred to as Brilliant Brumby and the Worm. At the Worm, highlights include an extraordinary 171,000 parts per billion stream sediment sample, several rock chip samples above 20 grams per tonne, and excellent soil sampling results with multiple samples containing visible gold. A potential trend in the mineralisation with a combined strike length of more than one kilometre has been delineated. A ground magnetic survey at the Worm has successfully identified four priority drill hole targets for follow-up exploration. Seven kilometres to the northwest of Brilliant Brumby, comprehensive rock chip sampling has been undertaken to determine the extent and quality of the mineralisation. A ground magnetic survey identified numerous large-scale structures displaying magnetite destructive alteration, typical of quartz vein mesothermal Charters Tower style gold mineralization that is well known for its high-grade and deep structures carrying significant gold ore. Large-scale geological structures have been identified which appear to represent potential along a two-kilometer strike length for significant gold mineralization from the surface to at least 120 meters depth. Interestingly, these structures are underexplored and had never been drilled prior to Intergroup's first drilling program. A comprehensive drilling program of over 4,600 metres commenced in December 2013 and was completed in mid-2014. Multiple high-grade gold intercepts were encountered in the main Brilliant Brumby area, where historical workings produced 790 ounces from 950 tonnes, a grade of 25.9 grams per tonne. At Brilliant Brumby North, the best intersections were 6 metres at 3.93 grams per tonne in hole 14, including 1 metre at 21.4 grams per tonne and 1 metre at an impressive 74.9 grams per tonne in hole 39A at the very northernmost end of the existing drilling. This clearly indicates the deposits at Brilliant Brumby remain open along strike as well as at depth. The most significant drilling intercepts in terms of grade and downhole thickness in the main southern area were 7 metres at 3.49 grams per tonne including 1 metre at 21.9 grams per tonne in hole 10 and 16 metres at 0.48 grams per tonne in hole 7. Mineralisation at Brilliant Brumby is hosted by numerous deeply dipping quartz veins striking north-south in contrast to the general northeast-southwest trend of major faults and lineaments. In the Silica Ridge area, drilling produced the most encouraging results of the program to date, with 40 metres at 0.95 grams per tonne in drill hole 22, including 28 metres at 1.27 grams per tonne. Like the main brilliant Brumby deposit, Silica Ridge remains open both at depth and along strike. 
These thicker, lower grade zones in hole 22 suggest geological conditions are conducive for larger masses of mineralization, with higher gold grades being present in the immediate area. At similar depths, along trends indicated by surface magnetic lows and geochemistry. Slightly to the north of Silica Ridge is the mystery anomaly, where geology indicates a possible extension of two surface loads known as loafers, perhaps even extending to the surprise deposit located on the ridge at the northern end of the overall brilliant Brumby alteration zone. The historical surprise workings consisted of a 34-metre shaft which produced 1,650 ounces from 2,600 tonnes, a grade of 19.7 grams per tonne. Preliminary analysis of the nature of the brilliant Brumby deposits suggests the possibility of several shallow open cut pits to a depth of at least 120 metres. This allows for low cost production and accelerated lead times, enhancing the economics of the project and enabling early cash flow. With the potential for an intrusive driven bulk target at the worm and mineralized zones delineated at Brilliant Brumby, Intergroup Mining looks forward to follow up drilling to confirm continuation between the Brilliant Brumby, Silica Ridge and deposits further north. The area certainly contains major zones of gold mineralization of high grade, clearly including the potential for a major discovery.